What have you thought as you've watched the stock go uh, up 80% from $400 and change to uh, this morning looking at $836 in the pre-market? Well, you've got to remember that uh, 2014, when we were buying our stock, about a million six shares, an average price of $219. And as you know, since I've been on the show several times since, the stock went between 350 and 180 and 250 so it's all over. Um, and that period of time was when this company wasn't profitable, was expanding rapidly, they were being criticized by short sellers. Uh, it was very difficult for them to get started because uh, dealers would try to prevent them from selling cars in individual states. Um, but now things have all come together. And, uh, but in the period of time since 2014, the stock price didn't change very much through last summer. So through last summer, our $219 stock was 230 240 so we made 10%, 20%, 30%. At the same period of time, the company's business, we focus on business, not stock prices. The company's business had grown from $2.8 billion of annual revenues to $25 billion of annual revenues, eightfold. So the company's up eightfold, stock's up 20%, 10%. Now what's happening, this is just catch up. Now this year, uh, Tesla is going to do somewhere around $32 billion of revenues, and I guess that they're going to do $100 billion of revenues within four years. And I think they have potential for a trillion dollars of revenues within 10 years. So basically, you're looking at the very start of what Tesla, what's going to happen with Tesla. This could be one of the largest companies in the whole world. A trillion dollars in revenue in 10 years? That's assuming you do 10 million cars. There's 90 million cars or 95 million cars that are sold, yes. And that's without the battery business. So I'm thinking that it's seven, we're thinking $750 billion to a trillion dollars of revenues just on the car business. Elon says that the battery business is going to be as big as the car business. In addition to that, when I'm thinking about 10 million cars a year, the last com uh, conversation he had, he said it was 20 million cars is what he thinks he can do. And so what we're talking about is a business that right now demand is overwhelming for the product that they're selling. And they're constrained as far as making as many cars as they could sell because they don't have enough batteries. So now there's a nice move uh, announcement today about Panasonic making money in the plant they have in, uh, in Reno. Mm -hmm. uh, but they, they need to have more batteries. So they're going to have a battery day in, the, uh, in a few months. They're going to have all the analysts coming out and they're going to show how they're addressing the issue of where are these batteries going to come from to make all these cars that are possible to make.